I shall see who it is. Huh? Oh. You know, the velvet is wearing. We shall have to start using another chair soon. <laughs> it is a resistance. Michel, why are you here? Listen very carefully. I shall say this only once. When <laughs> I... There is no brie. I ate it last night. Listen, I shall say this only once. Rene! <laughs> the German officers cannot stay in the room of my mother. London will be calling on the radio. The radio is under her bed and the loudspeaker is in her chamber. If the Germans hear a voice coming from a chamber pot, our cover will be blown. <laughs> Shut up! Michelle has something to tell us. Listen very carefully. I shall say this only once. <laughs> what is it you are going to say? I haven't said it yet. If you listen, I will tell you. The suspense is killing me. <laughs> the two British airmen wearing the German uniforms have been captured. No! Yes! No! Yes! No! Yes! <laughs> will nobody believe this woman? <laughs> Get on with your story. They have been captured by the resistance. Then why are we worried? They have not been captured by our resistance. What other resistance is there? The communist resistance. What are you? De Gaulle. De Gaulle? He is the tall one. With the big hooter. <laughs> but can you not just ask them if we can have our uniforms back? We do not know where they are hiding them. What is more, we do not speak to them. When the war is over, whichever is the strongest group will control France. The communists are ruthless killers. We will have to eliminate them. But we cannot get those Germans out of here without uniforms. Oh, the uniforms are no problem. London can do anything. I cannot tell the Germans I'm in touch with London. <laughs> Will that me shut? We could tell them Monsieur Leclerc de Fougere is a tailor, and he is going to make them new uniforms. René, you are married to a very clever woman. Well, I have always preferred brains to beauty. <laughs> Unless they are big knockers. <laughs> Go and tell Leclerc. Look, how can we get uniforms from London? The wireless is under the bed and the Germans are in the wardrobe. This is no problem. We will send the message by pigeon. We have no pigeons. They will be provided. Tomorrow morning at midday, you will go to 36 Rue d'Escargot. You will knock three times <laughs> and they will give you pigeons. To avoid suspicion, you will be disguised as a small boy. But why can't I be disguised as a small girl? Because you are a small girl. <laughs> <laughs> you know 